Search continues for a father and his three children. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Debbie Knox. Bob is off tonight. Kyle Mormon and his children were last seen Wednesday. CBS 4's Eric Graves has information now on a possible sighting just last night. He's not just gone. He didn't just leave us. There's something wrong. Natasha Hayes and her family have been searching for her son Kyle Mormon and his three kids since Friday morning. Any place that we could think of that Kyle would have went to, we have been. Hayes says Mormon left home late Wednesday night with his three kids, five-year-old Kyle the second, two-year-old Kiana, and one-year-old Kyron. He was supposed to meet up with his brother to go fishing, but never showed up. It's not like Kyle just to run off and not say nothing to none of us. An IMPD spokesperson says they are investigating. The spokesperson says a silver alert or amber alert hasn't been sent out yet because the kids are believed to be with their father and not in danger. Hayes says they're worried they are in danger. We don't know if they're eating. We don't know what is going on. We just want them home. The family's top priority is finding the car Mormon was last seen in. Here's a picture of it. It's a 2009 black four-door Saab with a donut tire on the driver's side front wheel and a paper license plate. If we can find where his car is, then maybe that can lead us to where he, to where him and the babies are. Paul Keenan is a retired FBI agent and current co-founder of security consulting business Factor. He says finding the car could be a big change in the investigation. If there's any kind of evidence in the car that may lead them, uh, give them further leads in order to find the kids. Maybe the phone is in there. Maybe there's a notebook. As family continued searching Monday afternoon, a new development potentially changes the investigation. The Boone County Sheriff's Office confirmed to CBS4 they got a call from this Cracker Barrel in Whitestown claiming the four were spotted there Sunday night. Deputies reviewed the video and believe the people in the video match the description of Mormon and his three kids. The video has now been turned over to IMPD for investigators to review for themselves. If you have seen Kyle, any of his three kids, or that 2009 black sob, you are asked to call IMPD or Crime Stoppers. That number is 317-262-TIPS. If you'd like to get involved in the search for Kyle and his children, we have a phone number you can call right now on our website. Reporting on the near south side, Eric Graves, CBS4 News.